Hello guys, Keep on TV here, back for yet another match review. So it's finished, Birmingham City 2, Stoke City 0. Another home win, three wins from three at home. What a performance that was. And we have pulled clear of the bottom three. Furthermore, now nine points above um, Rotherham. So I think if we win that game against Rotherham next Sunday, that will guarantee us survival. So getting onto the line, of course, um, we started with the same team that played against Swansea. So near leverage in goal, Harder Dean, Pedersen, Mark Roberts, the three centre backs. Um, then we had uh, Steve Seddon um, replacing McGree, playing as a left wing back. Colin as a right wing back. Sunic and Garner in the middle. And then Halovic as a cam. And then um, Jukovic and um, Jonathan Lecco. Scott Hogan was injured. Ivan Sanchez was on the bench. And, um, the, you know, the, I thought Stoke weren't looking not to be 1-0 down, to be honest. I mean, they had a couple of chances on the break. Um, you know, we, we Hardy Dean with a mistake that led to a goal that was disallowed. But still, I don't know what Hardy Dean is doing there, giving the ball away on the halfway line. And that could have cost us. Uh, could have cost us. Um, I, I, I think the first half was awful, to be honest. Absolutely awful. No one could pass. Both teams couldn't pass. But in the 40th minute, Mark Roberts puts in a brilliant delivery. And who's there? Who's there? Luka Zukovic, trademark header. And he scores two in. No, not two in two, sorry. He could have scored. Yeah, he could have scored against Swansea. But um, he made it for that missed penalty that he uh, missed against Swansea and scored to make it 1 0. What a delivery by Mark Roberts, by the way. Absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant delivery. Uh, delivery sorry. And then um, before the second half. McGree come off and um, I'm trying to think who come on now. Um, I, I don't know. I, 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 McGree, I think it, it wasn't George Fenn, was it? Let me know in the comments who actually come on. Anyway, yeah, the second half, we was dominant in the second half. I thought the first half, you know, Stoke were pretty... Stoke were unlucky not to be 1-0 up. Um, so yeah, the second half, like I said, a completely dominance. Got the second goal early on in the second half as well. McGree with the shot. And um, yeah, Lukas Zukovic was there to tap it in to make it 2-0. And then we just saw the game out from there. We could have made it three. We had a couple of chances on the counter-attack. Leko messing up. So, you know, it's another win at home. And uh, we are staying up now as official. The Lee Bowyer revolution continues. It continues and it continues in style as well. What a performance from Blues, especially in the second half. It's another clean sheet yet again. Um, I thought Neil Leverage didn't. I thought Neil Leverage done well. You know, uh, he didn't put us in the danger. But there was that moment in the first half where um, he punched a ball and uh, it hit a Stoke player, and it just went wide of the post. I, I mean, if that one have gone in, that would have been, um, yeah, that would have been very unfortunate for Blues. Um, so yeah, two 0 win. I completely forgot as well to mention. Let's see if we can hit 50 likes on this match review. Blues are in dreamland. Oh, I'm absolutely ecstatic. Luka Zukovic has scored a brace, and it's the first. I heard someone say this is the first time in two and a half years that we've kept. Three clean sheets in a row. Um, incredible. I thought it meant at home, but I just, yeah, we got that 0-0 uh, draw against Reading then Swansea and then beat Stoke. Stoke are a team in mid-table as well. But the thing is now, the thing is now we don't have to really rely on Rotherham. Uh, Sheffield Wednesday lost the course. The results went our way today, except for Rotherham losing. They got a point away at Huddersfield. We are now above Huddersfield, Derby. So, you know, I think it's very, very, I think that's safe to confirm. Amazing performance. Lee Bowyer, you're an absolute legend, absolute hero. The transformation that you have done to this team is just ecstatic, just unbelievable. I thought Jonathan Lecker, by the way, he hit the bar. Um, the guy, even if he did score, it would have been offside. But I think Jonathan Lecker had a poor game, to be honest. Um, that young kid, come on. And uh, yeah, he, he just. He didn't look ready. Anyway, it's been keeping on TV. Make sure to like, share, and also subscribe to the channel. Oh yeah, it was no. I completely McGree. McGree didn't didn't McGree didn't start. Sorry, Halovic come off at half time for McGree. I don't know why I thought McGree started. Anyway, leave your thoughts down below in the comments. Three points.
Lee Bowyer is a hero. The revolution continues. Keep right on.